The Large Hadron Collider is the most ambitious scientific experiment ever attempted. A 27-kilometer enclosed ring punctuated by four enormous camera-like detectors will mimic and record events seconds after the Big Bang in the hope of finding the answers to life, the universe, and everything. Atlas and CMS are the largest of these detectors. They are so huge that each has its own 2,000-person construction team. But before the scientists can begin to tinker with these mega toys, there's the small problem of creating a home for these enormous machines. That calls for world-class engineering. Everybody was waiting for civil engineering to finish because the physicists can't do anything without the infrastructure in place. John Osborne is the project engineer responsible for constructing the caverns to house these giant machines. At this particular site, there was one small uh, shaft going down to the tunnel, but that wasn't sufficient for LHC, so you'd have to excavate two massive new shafts and two huge caverns for the CMS detector, the site we're on now. This is the biggest uh, cavern that's been excavated in this type of rock. On this one particular site, we excavated 220,000 meters cubed of, of rock and gravel to form these two new caverns, so it's, it's a huge scale of uh, construction. These caverns are two of the biggest underground areas ever created. Having taken a decade and a half to build, at a cost of over 3 billion euros, the Large Hadron Collider and its giant detectors will only have around 10 years to find the answers to life, the universe, and everything. After this, the world's biggest atom smasher will reach the end of its useful life, and a new collider will take over.